Here we have a 2017 17-pack BMW 435D M Sport X Drive Grand Coupe. Now we do have four superb unscratched unmarked 19-inch alloy wheels in gloss black with the blue M Sport brake calipers just hiding behind. Now we do have the LED headlights as well as the black Hinegos, genuine carbon fibre BMW front splitter. Now we do have black accents all along this vehicle, so you do get the black accents on the two front wings. We have the black window trim and also the privacy glass on the rear. On the rear. Now we do have front and rear parking sensors with dual X exhaust flush with a rear bumper and also the rear diffuser. Now we do have a power assisted tailgate, front touch a button on the key and also on the inside, which reveals a nice spacious size boot, as you can see just there. Now it's also power assisted back down again from a touch of a button. Now this vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches and rear does look superb from every angle. Now if we go to the rear, I'll show you a bit of the interior of this car. Now, as you can see, we do have the cream full Dakota leather throughout with the ISOFIX points. Pull down RMSs in the centre, which reveals two nice size cup holders. Now, you do also have your vents just in the centre, electric windows, and you also have your integrated Harman Kardon speakers just there as well. Go to the front. There's a look at the driver's full leather front seat. Now, the driver's seat is also heated, electric, and memory. Then the passenger seat is just electric and heated. Electric windows on the doors with your electric power forwarding mirrors and you also your integrated Harman Kardon speakers. Jumping inside, can't look just down there. You have your auto lights, foot on the brake, touch your button, you do also have your keyless start. Now we do have a multi-function steering wheel with paddle shift if we stick the car into manual mode. Now this vehicle is free for many more lights on the dashboard and is covered just over 41,260 miles. Now I have cruise control and speed limits on the left-hand side of the multi-function steering wheel. On this stock, you have your auto high beam assist, and you also have your auto wipers just there as well. Satellite navigation screen just in the centre. Now ignore that flicker, that is just the phone, nothing to do with the screen. Now you do have your satellite navigation just there. You also have your media connectivity, so you do have your DAB radio, FM, AM, music collection, CD, DVD, Bluetooth audio, and also USB. Bluetooth phone connectivity just there as well. Now you do also have your navigation. Pop kind to reverse. Visual display of your front and rear parking sensors. Pop back into drive. You do also get different drive modes. We have your Eco Pro, Comfort, Sport, and also Sports Plus. Now coming down here, you have your dual zone climate control. Now it works exactly how you would expect it to. You also have your two heated front seats from touch a button. Both work exactly how you would expect it to. Storage just down here. Two nice size cup holders, 12 volt connectivity, which will fold over. Traction control on and off. Drive mode set, parking sensors, and this is what you use to control Evan hubs on your screen. Soft touch lever armrest, which moves forward to back to suit your driving position, which also has storage just in there with USB. And there's a look at the passenger's full Dakota leather front seat with the extended fire spot. Now this vehicle is available to take away today with free contactless nationwide next day delivery. It's HPI Claire comes with fresh service, new MOT, and we do have competitive lay finance. Thank you very much for watching. Been in test drive of this BMW 435D X Drive M Sport Grand Coupe. Now, the purpose of this video test drive today, of course, is to show that the vehicle drives exactly how you'd expect them to. As you can see, I'm not up to fight with steering wheel to keep it straight line, it's going straight and true, not moving off to the left or to the right hand side. Now, we do have cruise control and speed limits on the left hand side of the multi function steering wheel. Now, to fact, fix it, push the button at the bottom and use the dial to push up and down to find your selected speed. Push up very slightly, or just by one, push up to a little bit of a flick and just hit near five miles an hour. Now to cancel, so you just push the button again, or tap brakes, and then it will then cancel. Now with the heads up display, you can actually see the miles per hour that you've set the cruise control at as well. Now do you have power shift if we take the car into manual mode. So we're taking left at the roundabout, as you would if you're test driving the vehicle today. And I'll take over using the paddle shift. So we're just coming up to the roundabout now. Drop it down, and so I'll go into second, up to third, into fourth, into fifth, and then I'm going to simply just let go and let the car take it back over. Now, we do have the auto wipers on the right hand stalk. We also have your auto high beam assist, which is button on the left hand stalk. We have your integrated Harman Kardon speakers, which do sound absolutely incredible, matched with the satellite navigation. So, we do have the Pro Nav, we do have the satellite navigation, we have DAB radio, Bluetooth audio, Bluetooth media connectivity. We also have Bluetooth phone connectivity, visual display of front and rear parking sensors, and the list also goes on. 
Now the two front seats are also heated, uh, both electric, but the driver is also has the memory function. For those cold winter mornings, the, the heated seats really do make all the difference. Now these seats are very comfortable, you can quite easily do two, three, even four miles in this vehicle, but still get out feeling fresh. You do have a lot of adjustable points, so you have your bolt where it brings you in and out, and also lots of other different features. Now we have the gearbox, now I've pushed it to the left, it either goes in S or M, S being the sports function, so it revs to the rev range a lot longer and sharpens up those gear changes. And you can also push up and down, you can use that the manual function there as well. Push back to the right hand side, it goes back into normal automatic driving mode. Now if you test drive this vehicle today, you can be listening out for any wooden knocks or bags. If you're listening out during this test drive video, there hasn't been any, which is always a burden to my bag, you can use the car. Here at Ars Car Sales, we do offer free nationwide next day delivery. So wherever you are in the country, we can facilitate that. Whether you're north of Scotland or down in Cornwall, we do offer the free nationwide next day delivery. So right now, coming to industrial site, we're going to take a right, we're going to perform a emergency stop, and pop it straight into reverse. Just show the brakes work exactly how you'd expect them to, and you'll probably see pop up in the centre screen the visual display of the front and rear parking sensors. So pulling in now. So three, two, one. Hard anti brakes straight into reverse, no issues whatsoever. And you can see popped up in the centre, the front and rear parking sensors, the back into drive again, no issues whatsoever. Now, if you haven't answered all of your questions and queries during these test drive and walk around videos, please feel free to get in contact with the sales team where they can answer your answer questions and also run through some inquiries with you. But that's it for me in this walk around video and video test drive. Hope to hear from you soon. Cheers.